protest today, protesting the continued exile of their leaders. Leaders of three opposition parties, which include former Prime Minister Tom Tabane, have vowed to stay in South Africa until their security is guaranteed. And Army Commander Lieutenant General Tladi Kumoli is removed. Conspicuous by its absence, the Lesotho opposition says this parliament is not in charge of the country and that enough is enough. Our leaders are eager to come back to Lesotho, are eager to come home, but they want to come home peacefully. They want their lives to be assured that there won't be any threats or any further um, uh, persecutions to them. But as long as uh, this country is in control of the army and the army is still defying uh, the, 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 the orders of the cause, so really there is no guarantee that um, our leaders will be safe in this country. The government maintains it has tried to extend an olive branch. Very much significantly, especially by the prime minister, who went, and I suspect twice, to South Africa. First of all, they negotiated, met in Johannesburg, uh, with uh, the leader of opposition, Dade Tabani, but later went to Glockholland. They met there, halfway between Maseru and Fixburg. According to the constitution, if members don't attend a third of the seatings, they may forfeit their seats. But more importantly, the boycott is unlikely to have an impact on proceedings. Not at all. Technically speaking, you need only 30 members because the quorum in this house is 30 members. So the government uh, or the governing coalition has 65 members. So even if half of those members of government attend, that would be enough for a quorum for anything to be transacted validly. The opposition will present its grievances next week, but it's not backing down. We are not going to back off. We won't be allowed to be intimidated by the government to, uh, to scare us going there. We are going to stop our salaries and all that stuff. I think um, the peace, the stability of this country is more important than our salaries. For now, it is not clear if the absence of the opposition in this chamber will have an impact on the legitimacy of proceedings for the House. But for now, it has made a statement. Ntakwana Ngatani, SABC News, Maseru Lesotho.